All right, hello, welcome back everybody. PayPal and Patreon and the membership button are down below if you want to support me and we do so if you actually can. So I did a similar video in the past regarding the rough time frame when the global population most likely actually passed the 8 billion line. And now I'm doing one for India as this or around right now, roughly April of this year is when India has in reality most likely passed a population level of 1.4 billion. Now, just as with the world population 8 billion moment, you probably saw India passing 1.4 billion in the news months ago, or even maybe a year or two ago. And that is because, just like with the world population, or basically any other population numbers, the news media are relying on not data from India or from any UN agency or any country's demographic agencies, they're usually just pulling those numbers from population clock websites like this one or this one or this one, all of whom you'll see have different numbers for the world or any individual country. And that is because they were created at different times and have all been plugged in with different algorithms that they're just running on and that for the most part have not been updated at all for five years, ten years. However, India actually releases vital statistics, demographic data, and they, like many other countries, despite the still somewhat attached stereotype of Indians having a million kids each, their birth rate or fertility rate has been falling just like everybody else's over the course of time, and they are now, to many people's surprise, under 2. And they're around 1.9 or 1.8 children per woman as of present day, which combined with primarily outward immigration trends, has India's present population pyramid looking more like this, with the newest age brackets, the newest years beginning to contract compared to those roughly 20 years above them. Thusly, India is no longer adding 25 million people every year. They actually, as of 2023, or over the course of 2023, added about 12 million people, and that number, the number they're adding, is decreasing each year. So now April is the most likely time that they would have crossed the 1.4 billion line since that 1.386 was at the end of 2023 or start of 2024. And, and if you assume that they stayed at an addition of at a net gain of 12 million people per year and did not continue decreasing, then 12 million people per year is 1 million per month. So that's 12 million over 2024 last year, which would put it at 1.398 at the start of this year. And then January and February, the first two years, will put it at 1.4. But it probably went down to a net addition of 11.5, maybe on of 11.7 million people or something last year. So we allotted the month of March to pass by as an additional safety buffer so that we can say now here in April of 2025, India has actually most likely reached a population of 1.4 billion with their increase getting smaller each year, like most other countries that are still increasing. And their, and their likely peak population, which you can see here on this graph, and if you click the link in the corner, you can see a video I did, or it might have been a stream, I don't know, where I went through a bunch of different population projections for a number of other countries as well. But whereas in the past, back at the start of the 21st century, everyone was panicking and thought India was going to end up with a population of 2.5 billion at some point, and then once we hit around 2010, everyone adjusted those projections down to accepting the reality that India would peak below 2 billion. And then it was adjusted down to 1.8 around 2020. And now most of the UN population projection stuff is starting to get in line with reality. And their new expectation is around 1.6 or 1.7. But there's usually a lot of flaws involved with those, like 
insisting or assuming that declining fertility rates are just going to immediately level off right where they are and stay exactly at these exact numbers. So in reality, taking that into account, India is most likely going to hit a peak or maximum population in a couple decades a bit under 1.6, probably between 1.54 and 1.57 billion would be the rough range I would say you could pinpoint it at. So there you go. This was a short one. Don't take up too much of your time. Like if you enjoyed, subscribe if you haven't already. Check out any of the other hundreds of videos I have on all kinds of other stuff. PayPal and Patreon and YouTube membership links are down there if you want to support me. Only do so if you actually can. There's a link in the description to a Google Drive with folders full of all kinds of different graphs across all kinds of different subjects and metrics. That's all free to access, free to use anytime. There's a link to my photography Instagram as well. There's one to my cat's YouTube channel in the top pinned comment. May God bless and protect all of you. And I will see you all around next time.